I'm sorry for the poor lighting, but uh, I'm going to start putting some stain on the back. A little bit of work on the neck. And uh, get started with this. Best of luck with the uh, neck. Mostly because I'm just not super good at this, but we're going to put on a thin coat. Let it dry. I tried a grain sealer on a uh, test piece of wood with this uh, with this stain, and I just didn't like the way it worked. It didn't uh, didn't get into the the grain and bring out the grain the way I wanted. So now I'm just gonna. I got some on there. I'm gonna work it around while it's still sort of and then we'll just We'll let that dry and come back and sand it. All right, starting to get a little bit of the color that I'd like. Uh, decided to go, had to put a few coats on and sand out, getting a little bit of blotchiness. Um, oh, there's a rough spot there. Hitting it with some uh, 400 grit sandpaper. And this next time I'll probably hit it with steel wool and uh, maybe one more coat see how it uh, how it looks after that getting just I sanded this down a little bit heavier try and get just a little bit of a a lighter tone on the hump there and uh, we'll see if we can get it to even out and then we'll move on to the next section got the neck hanging up over in the corner there and uh, I'm pretty much done with the stain on that one. Um, once I get the stain on the body, it'll be time to put together, uh, glue it up, string it up, and see if I can, uh, before I put a finish on it, um, do the wiring. I've got the wiring sitting over here on my messy, messy table. Um, I used a sheet of cardboard. Um, traced out with paper and then uh, the holes on the front of the guitar and then uh, put holes in here for the pots. I'm going to replace these pots. These pots are are pretty crummy. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use the switch that's in there. For now use the pickups even though I'm probably going to replace those uh, with some better pickups. Uh, this is a jack, jacks or jacks. Um, but the pots, they sent uh, four pots um, for three volumes and one tone, but they sent, uh, they sent uh, two linears and two audio taper pots. So I'm going to have to replace the, the uh, one linear needs to be an audio anyway for the volumes. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and switch everything over. Uh, to audio tapers and uh, better quality pots. I think that's going to be the best in the long run. So anyway, that's where the wiring is right now. And uh, going to keep finishing, be a few days, a little bit of finish at a time.